I couldn't give a shit about death. Acid Man was built to be a chemist. What's he good for? Titrations? <laughs> That's a chemistry. Can I get a whoop? Woo! You, we'll work on it, Clay. Make sure to stay away from that pharaoh seed. And that's just one name people have for weed. Humans are real squishy, really, when you think about it. What is your greatest intangible fear? This is a pretty heavy one. I guess my greatest fear would be, like, not being able to remember my loved ones and just, like, losing that sense of self. So probably, I guess it would just be memory loss is probably my greatest intangible fear. Nine, what is your greatest tangible fear? Horses. It has a propensity for lying and for drinking alcohol. But just when all hope seemed lost, I had an epiphany. I am going to throw myself into the sea. With all the spell casting and shouting you must do as Dragonborn, who really has the time to read all those books? I do, apparently. My second reaction to this was what the fuck? Hey, Todd? What the- You'll be drowsy if you swallow that tangro smoke. Also coughing and wheezing. Hey, you might much up. Technically not murder. Definitely bad. I'm alone in my apartment. That means I can do anything. I'm alone in my apartment. That means I can do anything. But I'm on the land or on the sea. In the name- Surely you can't afford 17 million dollars in fines. I'm willing to let bygones be bygones. OSHA doesn't need to hear about all this evidence I've compiled. Final destination is just flying around through random parts of space. There's no protection. You should be less worried about getting punched into oblivion and more worried about the cancer. What an amazing role for me as Waluigi. Think of the accolades, the game awards, the respect. As I, I mean, most of these monsters are pretty okay. Um, they're not the, they're like, they're not the most- Surprise! Sexy. I lulled you into a false sense of security. But shingles can be brought about by undue amounts of stress. Like if you're stressed about your job or your house or your bank account or bed bugs or the small amount you exercise or the political environment or gun control or the situation in North and South Korea, even though they say they're no longer at war, but that seems way too easy. It happened in second planting, PD 1220, that Lord Ichlandam, on a journey in the western uplands, came to Nahulift and Protector Ankard and General Kungthunch met him there, and Dalen Zanchu also came to the meeting. They talked. Hi, I'm Brian David Gilbert, safety fan and bureaucratic wunderkind. Please address me as such. Are they friends? Accomplices? Lovers? Ooh, come on. You don't have to be good at cooking to do this, you just have to be good at arse. Let's start with something easy going and figure out when Mario's gonna die. If you're wondering how I got this name, let me tell you. I played Lumiere once. Things didn't go so hot. That's how I fell into this mercenary business. It's a new dance move for me. I don't know if I like it. Of course it does. It reminds you of the Commedia dell'arte because it reminds me of the Commedia dell'arte. Even in the apocalypse, you can't escape the guy who will bring his guitar to your party. Thank God the bombs went off before Wonder Woman. I've been dealing with this small bastard's antics for so long, I need to remind myself why he's here by quantifying his value. Oh God, am I a buzzkill? Yeah. Okay, you know what? Just for fun, let's just throw some random numbers in here just to, just for, just to see, you know, just as, just for fun. <laughs> oh God. Except they're really 400 years old and a god or a dragon. And I honestly do not have the time to unpack this bullshit. I got a cut on my hand. I mean, I cut off my hand, put some Old Bay on it and down. It's a crab claw. But I don't think I can figure out the real world price of a firebomb without getting put on a watch list. He must also have a crooked mustache, a large nose, and a love of kicking. Hmm. The ice cream truck version of Pop Goes the Weasel, which, for reasons I don't understand, always makes me cry.